it for Germany because even though they've obviously lost this tie, uh, if it ends up being close for second in the group potentially, even if the uh, Koreans win it, then it could be used to separate if there are two nations in the same second position. Well, there are the four women who were about to do battle. They're just coming out on court now in front of me for the final match of uh, this tie. And in fact, uh, we are the only call uh, where there's uh, action. Play having finished on courts uh, two and three. So we've got, we and they have got the auditorium all to themselves. Five love, the head to head, although the last meeting did go to three games. So Kim Soo-young, they're ranked uh, fifth, which is their highest. She went to the uh, University of Incheon. And as a pair, they were the most improved, or well, one of the most improved Player of the Year awards in uh, 2019. Got to the World Tour final 2020 on the Thai Open in January. So that's a measure of the task. We look at uh, Kong Hee Young. An Olympic bronze, of course, in Tokyo, these two. So, banging form, ranked inside the world's top five. They are a class act in anyone's language. Having said that, as you saw on, on the screen a few minutes ago, they did take a game off from last time they met, Linda Effler and Isabel Lohel. Effler is uh, 26. Ranking of 31 is their highest. National champions uh, in both 29 and 2020. Effler actually is a runner-up in the mixed doubles at the US Open a few years back. And we saw Isabel Lohel earlier in the uh, mixed doubles, which uh, she won with Mark with Mark Ramsfus. Excellent all-round game and particularly good at the net. I think we'll see her trying to exploit her strength in that area against uh, these two Koreans. Chair umpires from the States, uh, Philip Young Chi and uh, Stefan Venet of France is the service judge. So stand by for the uh, chair umpire's player introductions. Ladies and gentlemen, on our right, Germany, represented by Linda Effler and Isabel Lohan. And on the left, Korea, represented by Kong Hee Yong, Kim So Yong. Germany to serve Linda Effler.
Rathburn to Kim Soyong. The ball. Play. So here we go. Final match in this tie. Always think when you've when you've won five previous meetings, the big psychological edge. And that's the case here in the uh, Korean women's favour. Bit wild from Low How. I think if they're going to have any chance, clearly they need to cut out unforced errors and just try and put the Koreans under pressure. I think the plan will certainly be to try and get Lohal to the net whenever they can. That was a great get by uh, Kong Hee Yong. It really was. Didn't help them win the point though. Missed it. Just the wrong side of the line from Kim So Young's point of view. Well, it's been a good start from uh, Eflu and Lohau. Four some errors from. The uh, higher rank pairing, You're doing it well so far. Well, that was just too short from uh, Kong Hee Young. Made it a very easy kill. Well, a pity from her point of view, she pushed that wide because it had been good defence from the two Germans up to that moment.
Well, it's just long, but what is good to see, I think they might challenge this. Are they going to challenge it? I think they are. What's good to see, regardless of whether this challenge uh, is upheld or not, is they've come in with such a, a positive approach. I'm trying to throw the Koreans uh, off their stride. It's well out. Well, that was great play from uh, Lohan in particular, the back of the court in that rally. Great defence again from Eflin and Lohan. <laughs> Unlucky, they were just worn down in the end, but it wasn't for the want of trying. rally of the match there's not been much in it at all from the get-go here seven six yeah just wasn't deep enough, was it? That was the problem. Him so young, very quick onto that. And didn't disappoint. Once again, patience is a virtue. They always look like they have the upper hand in that particular rally. Just starting to fritter away a few points, aren't they? Eflin and Lohal. And understandable, because they're being put under tremendous pressure by the two Korean women. Eflin in particular. Yeah. 
Oh, I don't expect Kim So Young to miss shots like that. On the line. So a three-point advantage for the Koreans as they go for the interval. So the German pair is still within range, but need to cut out giving away two points. Easy to say, much harder to do. Great poaching at the net. Kong Hee Young. So a great shot, followed by a slightly loose one. German's still interested here at 13 9 down. Judgment's been pretty good, Kim So Young and uh, Kong Hee Young, so far. I just wonder, do the Germans have the craft to somehow claw back this deficit? If not in this game, then they'll have to win the next two, obviously. Just looks like they're uh, they're mentally second best at the moment, Effler and Lovell. Oh, Well, stoic defence for a long time, but again, there was an element of inevitability about that point. Both the Koreans in close quarters for net. No chance at all for Low How to do anything there.
It just looked a little tired, that shot, didn't it? Just starting to really get in the ascendancy now. Kim So Young and Kong Hee Young. Steer beautifully. So I didn't see the one-sided nature of this scoreline coming. First uh, six or seven points, this was really close. But they've just stepped up a gear on Koreans. Just a couple of points away now from securing the opening game. Well, a little bit of good fortune, never hurts. So, 11 game points. Just hit the line, I think. Well, they're going to challenge it. Will be the game if the challenge is successful, but it looked like it... Uh, like it was a good call, but we'll see. Hit the line. Challenge unsuccessful. One challenge remaining. May just delay the inevitable, you suspect. But it did look good in normal speed. That'll do it. In pretty quick time too, just 18 minutes, 21 points to 11. And the Koreans have taken uh, control of this final match of the time.
Well, it's going to have to be a, a pretty big turnaround, you suspect, if the Germans are going to get back into this. But they did win a, a game in the previous meeting against Kim So Young and uh, Kong Hee Young. So, completely write them off. That's absolutely class from Isabel Lohel. Didn't come to her that high. To get that kind of trajectory was a good effort. remember in the first game it was pretty close early on and then gradually as the game wore on the Koreans just pulled away very quickly too Just wide, I think. Yeah. That's good poaching from uh, Linda Effler. Saw the opportunity, got across very quickly. And once she got there, very straightforward. A little careless that from Lohal. Uh, not the worst move to go for the flicker. She's going to challenge it actually. I want to say it looked out to me by a bit of a margin, but we'll see what Hawkeye says about the matter. Still waiting for. Hawkeye's verdict called out, remember, on the low house serve. Here we go. Oh, wow. What a good challenge that was. Take it all back, bring in service. Oh, oh. Well, 
that's good stuff again from Linda Effler. One of the reasons these two make a, a pretty decent combination, Effler from the back of the court and low help near the net. And cause problems even to pairs ranked above them. Similarly close start to the second game as it was in the first. That was well out. Well, I think she knew she'd made the wrong decision there, Kim So Young. Is that? Well, let's wait and see what Hawkeye says. I've been wrong before. Oh, it was out, okay. Good pressure from the Germans. German coach likes what he sees but it was a this kind of point in the first game that uh, the Koreans just seemed to move up a gear seamlessly and pretty smoothly too Let's see whether history's going to repeat here that's wide and that'll really encourage the Germans if they start to see Kim So Young and Kong Hee are making uh, unforced errors, gifting them a few points. Suddenly, get a real injection of confidence and a bit of heart. Terrific rally this. Oh, what a pity. What a pity that it ended on an error because that was... Best rally of the match by a, a country mile. Also the longest as well as the best. And in the end it was Oh how that cracked first.
Well, that's a bit sloppy. Oh, and a miscue. Not sure whether there's maybe a little bit of complacency creeping in, but they've more errors so far in this second game than they probably made in the whole of the first. They are hanging tough, aren't they, Linda Effler and uh, Isabel Lohau? Formerly uh, Isabel Hertrich, of course. On the line. And a lead of three points for the German ladies as they go to the chair. So, can the two Germans force a deciding game here? Work really hard to get their noses in front of the interval. It's a good start. Well, they needed that just to stop the rot, really. Uh, in by a long way. That's a bad misjudgment.
She's so good at the net, she really is. And you give her those kind of chances, she's just never going to pass them up. And uh, Kong Hee Yong probably reflect on that. The shots were really an open invitation. I feel low how to punish it. And these errors start to become contagious. And now, looking uh, very good to force a decide over two Germans. First unforced error for a while. But they may have already done the damage, we'll see. Because the Korean's going to have to up the level if they're going to get back into this second game. Guaranteed to win the tie, of course, but leave a sour taste when you lose uh, the last match. One of the few mistakes that uh, Lowhouse made in this game. Power from the back of the court again from Effler. No problem letting that go harmlessly wide of the sideline. But still the Germans in control of this second game. That's better. Some genuine pressure set up by Kim so Young. Well judged. Now, just a point in it. Who can hold their nerve the better? I wasn't actually out by that much. It's a good leave. Just when the Koreans are more positive, they look so much more dangerous. Almost like they somehow allowed the Germans to, to steal the initiative for most of this game. On the back foot, now they're trying to turn it round. Well, for once, Effler's power didn't produce the point. That was good defence from Kim Soo Young and Kong Hee Young.
Great reactions at the net again. And uh, Kim Soo Young and Kong Hee Young have definitely stepped it up. Job's not done yet though. Just when they got some momentum. The error from Kim Soo Young. out can't afford these mistakes with the scoreline as it is the Koreans a couple of points away from the match here got to make them work and make them win the point big point here and that's a really soft one and now three match points to Kim Seo Young and Kung Hee Young. Hardly been in front, they've only been in front right towards the end of this game. Can they finish it? For the flicker, interesting. Germans just disintegrated really in the latter part of that game. 21-17 it is, 43 minutes on court and a victory for the Korean women that means the overall score in the tie is 4-1 in Korea's favour and they will safely collect their point. The Germans probably now know that their only chance is to finish in second place. That's going to be a massive match against Chinese Taipei later in the week, Tahiti, the other team in the group, you would imagine the, Ger imagine the Germans would see them off relatively comfortably, but not over for Germany, that's for sure. Uh, Korea not 100% uh, at their best today. They lost the mixed doubles, but they've got the job done, and at the end of the day, that's the main thing. Just get yourself through to those quarterfinals, and they've given themselves an excellent chance of that. Easy put away at the end. They trailed for much of this final game, but at the business end, it was the Koreans who came out on top. Simple finish to end the match. Four and a half hours uh, this match has taken, or this tie rather than this match. Uh, deserving victory for Korea, but I'm sure the coaches will find room for plenty of improvement. Let's check on uh, today's results then, if you've uh, just come in. We started off with that German victory in the mixed doubles. After that, though, uh, the Koreans took control, although uh, Hyo Kwang Hee needed three games. It was tight. Uh, and Se Young anything but against uh, Yvonne Lee. And then uh, we saw uh, two love wins in both the men's and the women's doubles. So 4-1, the final score in favour of Korea. Well, don't forget the action continues tomorrow. This is just the first of eight days of coverage. Please join Paul Hand tomorrow. For me, Trevor Harris, all of us here, it's goodbye for now.